Maple leaves ain't fall and die I guarantee on death and life Love is guaranteed strife Whether or not you were my wife and If you give up every time I choose to live a nothing life I Place the old up with the new Every time you are confused You are confused You are confused Maple leaves It's Greg and Celiacs it's Kevin here with the Taste Test Tuesday today, and I'm going to be testing out the next two flavors of the Enjoy Life Foods Crunchy Cookies. Uh, over here I have the vanilla honey graham and then the double chocolate. Um, so really I just want to kind of, you know, quick start. Usually my taste tests take a little bit longer than my other episodes, and I'm trying to kind of keep it, you know, maybe around the three, four minute range usually, I guess. So, um, yeah, not to kind of, you know, speed it up too much, but I used to have episodes that were like over ten minutes, and that's just a little too long, you know, it kind of gets a little, I mean, just too much, I guess. So... Go ahead and get this one kicked off. And I had a couple cups of coffee, so I'm kind of all over the place again. I don't know. I just, you know, on my days off, today was my day off, and I'm really enjoying it, that's for sure. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. I just end up, you know, having a couple cu couple cups off of the Keurig, and then I just start going crazy with it. So, all right, well, let's give this one a shot then. I really like that. I mean, it's not too sweet, and like the vanilla is, you know, more subtle. It's not just overpowering. Um, a lot of times, you know, if it's like going to be the first thing in the description, you know, so vanilla honey gram kind of goes right down the line as far as, you know, what's the most, you know, powerful thing. So it's really still like a honey gram base is like, you know, almost like a graham cracker. Um, but it has, you know, a little hint of vanilla. So I really like it. It's just kind of interesting, something that you don't usually have. So. I could probably eat these things all day. I probably will, actually. You know what? These would probably be pretty good to dunk in coffee. But uh, I might have to move to decaf, that's for sure. Man, those are good. All right, and then here we have the double chocolate. And again, these products, um, they actually post it right here on how allergen-friendly they actually are. And I've discussed before... Um, actually on a few different episodes, I don't know how many you guys have seen, you know, but um, so they're free of all the eight FDA, you know, the major allergens that the FDA posts, like contains this, contains this, you know. So the wheat, dairy, peanuts, tree nuts, fish, shellfish, eggs, soy, uh, that's everything, yeah. And then they also do without casein, uh, potatoes, um, sesame, and sulfites. So that's pretty cool too. So just little things, you know, allergens that you have to look out for. And as far as the flour mixture on these ones, these are uh, just white rice flour, buckwheat flour, and then millet flour. So uh, go ahead, you know, check those out. And I mean, these are very good. And like the texture, you know, I mean, it again, it like depends. I mean, you're either, you know, like the crunchy cookies or you like the softer cookies. You know, it's usually not both. But um, yeah, so these are definitely crunchy cookies. I got that name for a reason. Uh, so a little bit harder texture, but overall just very good taste. Oh, these smell good. <laughs> yeah, this smells like pretty much brownie in a cookie. That's serious chocolate right there. Very interesting. Um, and I mean, it's just, as far as the chocolate chips, it's just cane juice, chocolate liquor, and non-dairy cocoa butter. I mean, they do a pretty natural, pretty, you know, easy going, and really has a great chocolate taste to it. I like these a lot as well. I mean, they just have really good flavors. So, you know, I would be hard pressed to find you guys not liking the flavor of these cookies. It's really dependent on the texture. Um, personally, I like the texture of these, but, uh, you know, I, it really just depends on that, I guess. Yeah, I'm a big fan of these, definitely. Um, so these, I mean, I, and if you haven't seen, like, the kind of part one of the Taste Test Tuesdays with Enjoy Life Foods, Go and check that out, and you can see the other two flavors that I tested. Uh, it was the sugar cookie and then the uh, the chocolate chip. So, yeah, you can always go check those out as well. Um, something pretty cool is, I don't know if you guys have ever heard of KO. Um, Kevin, I can't remember his last name, but um, he plays the cello and he beatboxes, and he puts out a few YouTube videos. Well, anyway, I just sent him out an email this morning. Um, so I had just been told about this uh, guy just last night, actually. Um, and, you know, went ahead, I looked through all of his YouTube videos, you know, just loved it. And uh, so I went, and e went ahead and emailed him this morning. And, and anyway, he just said right away, you know, I mean, it was within probably 20 minutes or something like that, where he said, you know, 
hey, you have you know my full permission to use you know any of my music, you know that kind of thing. So I thought that was very cool. Uh, really excited to actually get that one going on the next episode, so you guys will see that intro then. Um, but yeah, really, that's everything for today. So I guess I'll see you on Friday for the Follow Friday episode.